This video gives an overview of how to install the stem wall system to a suitable wall. The system comprises of backboards made from plywood which are first fitted to the wall and then covered with plastic bases. Bases are populated with a regular hole pattern to permit pegs, screws and learning resources to be easily fitted to the front face of the stem wall. The activity wall provides endless opportunities for learning and play, so fit as many panels as you can to the selected wall surface to maximise the learning potential of the system. To install, first select a clean wall and make sure it is flat and smooth. The wall you are fitting the panels to should be made from concrete or brick and not be a stud or false wall. This will ensure a really good and trouble-free fixing for the life of the system. It even permits one person to fit the panels to the wall by themselves, although two people are recommended. Next, measure the height you wish to fit the walls above the ground. This needs to be between 100 and 150 millimeters. Make sure you have enough width to accommodate the panels. The larger ones are 800mm wide and 1200mm wide. If there is a window, notice board or any other obstruction on the wall or if your wall ends shorter than the 800mm width of the larger panel, you can select other panel sizes such as 200 by 200 mm panels and 200 by 400 mm panels to fill the whole wall space. You will notice at the back of the wooden panels there are three grooves and a metal strip inside one of them. These grooves and the strip are there to ensure you fit the wall panels accurately and squarely to the wall. The grooves are cut accurately at the back of the panels at 200, 400 and 600 millimetres from the bottom edge. So decide upon the height you want to fit the panels to and mark the wall with a horizontal line. Using a spirit level, check that the line is accurately level. Now fix the metal strip to this line using the screws and raw plugs provided. Remember the metal strip is actually a simple hanging rail just to make sure that the panels fit accurately to the wall and that they all align exactly. They are not the wall fixings, these come later. If you are fitting a line of panels, arrange the metal strips so they straddle between two adjacent panels to ensure they align precisely. Likewise, arrange the strips at any of the groove heights and between panels of differing sizes. Now hang the panels on the metal strips and make sure they butt up to each other tightly. Starting from one end, drill and fix the first panel in place using the larger screws and wall plugs provided. Continue along the wall, fixing all the panels until the wall is covered as required. Next, you need to fit the plastic bases, populated with holes, to the plywood panels. This is very straightforward because these are all precisely made and simply press fit into the face of the plywood and are then attached using the screws provided. Fit 24 bases to each panel, making sure that each one is connected to surrounding bases using the little plastic connecting lugs. These ensure they are precisely linked together and add strength to the structure. At the edges fit half sized lugs to finish them off without leaving any holes or spaces visible. The stem wall is now all ready to go.